tonight. Step up, throw the ball, that's a catch across the 15, down to the 12, down to the 10, down to the 9. Another first down, first and goal at the 9. Stanley Morrison, Eddie Brown, Lucas Patterson's out there right now for Texas A&M. Steps up, throws, incomplete at the five yard line. Morrison turning around, thinking he got interfered with. 50 seconds to go, 38 to 23 A&M. Utah State trying to get something late here. Going to throw, caught at the five, at the two, down at about the two yard line. Third down and goal, that went seven yards. They went to the clock play, they killed the clock. So it's going to be fourth down. He just stepped back and threw it into the ground. Yes. Clock play. See what they do on the fourth down. He wants to run, and he's going to get in. Burrell. They would have uh, 25 seconds. There's the extra point, and it's good. <laughs> you see it right there. The lady just waved up, Dave, and said she agrees with you. Look at all the crickets on his hat, man, right in front of him. He just, it's just covered. Here we go, the onside kick, and I think they may have gotten it, did they? Uh, I don't know. Well, they haven't, they they haven't signaled anything. Looks like they're going to review this. Under further review. Here we go. The play stands is called. First down, Utah State. First down and 10 at their own 42. And Burrell's under pressure, running away. Got away from a guy, now he's going to throw, and it is incomplete across the 30 and about the 27-yard line. That took a, uh, about seven seconds off the clock. Second down and 10 at their own 42, 18 seconds remaining. They get it after they score on an onside kick. Half back left, steps up into the pocket, forced out of the pocket. Gun on. He's going to throw, and... It is incomplete. Skip that one in across the 40 at the 38-yard line. Third down play. They've got to get to the Aggie 48-yard 40, uh, line on this one. But, of course, here's a... Did he toss it or was that a... He fumbled it. He fumbled it, and I think it's been recovered now by a Utah Stater. Oh, Aggies have recovered it. it. And it's going to be Von, uh, Von Miller. Kind of made it interesting here at the ends. Well, as, as Yogi says, it's not over till it's over. So they snap in, that's it. Well, um, I'm pleased to won a football game. That's part, uh, as I told the team, I said, you know, for about 90% of the game, with the exception of the penalties, um, I thought we played hard and, and, and played, for the most part, smart. But uh, right there at the end of the ball game, we did our best um, to self-destruct. Uh, offensively, we had a chance to put them away, uh, and we didn't do it. We had a chance right there in the red zone at the Drive Johnson's run, and then we had a penalty. Uh, that pulled the ball back into long yard situation. We get back into field goal range, and then we uh, we don't protect uh, our field goal kicker well enough, and we get a ball blocked. And then we allow them 12 plays, 76 yard drive to get down the field and score, kick the extra point. We allow them to kick an onside kick on us. So about 10 percent of the game, I'm very uh, displeased about. But uh, th that part of the game is important because uh, it can it can make or break you. But uh, I thought overall, um, I'd take my head off to Utah State. They were exactly what we said they were going to be. They played hard, and they competed the entire ball game, and uh, I thought they did a great job.
Aggie Band steps out into a company front formation from sideline to sideline. Executing left and right to the rear movements, the music will be the patent theme. From the staggered block formation, the band sounds off to them facing. From the North 30, the band returns to regular block formation of 12 files by 28 ranks. Featuring the 28-member strong Texas Aggie Band bass section and their famous four-step countermarch.
Ladies and gentlemen, the 303 number block speed. Combined band commanders, Cadet Colonel Jason Knight. The head drum major, Cadet Lieutenant Colonel Cody Work. Artillery band drum major, Cadet Major William O'Gorman. Infantry band drum major, Cadet Major Benjamin Rush. Ladies and gentlemen, before you on the playing field is the pulse of the spirit of Aggieland, the 2009-2010, the Fighting Texas Aggie Band. <laughs> 